Volunteers are organizing to fight against hunger in Tulsa. News on 6's Eden Jones shows us what they did today to help those in need. At Walltown Brewery, folks are setting up as they await volunteers. The first person to arrive is Linda Johnson, who brought a heaping box of sandwich ingredients, quickly tied her apron, and got to work. We got turkey here. And some, this is a nice name brand cheese here, Tillamook. Johnson's taking part in Feed the City, an initiative to feed the needy by assembling sandwiches to distribute across Tulsa. She's working hard to make each sandwich a delight. And we put our meat down, and then we put our mustard down, and then we put the cheese on because nobody likes a soggy sandwich. As more people flood in, Johnson is happy to share her table with others. I am amazed at the turnout today. Uh, this is the kind of group they need to have every time we do this. From the bottom of my heart, I did not expect this many people. Omid Gailey with Feed the City is astonished with the number of participants. First event of the year and all these people are showing up. It's just amazing. He says food insecurity can be a tough battle for some people in Tulsa, but it can be fought. At the end of the day, there are so many people who go hungry, who can't get food, whether it's men, women, seniors, children, veterans. So for me, like just being able to make a small difference is important. Johnson agrees and feels encouraged to lend a helping hand. It pressed on my heart, um, especially this past year, to kind of take care of the homeless, you know, food, clothing, all of that. And I think this is an excellent program. I was so excited when I heard about it. These sandwich making heroes aim to offer a hearty serving of hope, one delicious bite at a time. If you miss this gathering, don't worry, the group meets once a month. In Tulsa, Eden Jones, Oklahoma's own News on 6.